after seven Australian rugby players came out and took a stand and said, you know those gay pride jerseys that you're trying to force us to wear? We're not going to be a part of it. We're just not going to play the game if you're going to make us wear these jerseys. The mainstream sports media in both Australia and all around the world, including the United States, came out in force to attack these guys. They called them bigots. They called them homophobes. You've heard it all before simply for saying, listen, that doesn't align with my values and I'm not going to play. I respect everyone's right to live however they want, but I am not going to sit there and promote something like that. Well, apparently... It's inspired more people to do just that. Stand up and say, I'm not going to be a part of this woke virtue signaling garbage that has taken over the sports world. Report, more Aussie rugby league players revolt against gay pride jerseys. And this is from the Manly Sea Eagles. And this is the jersey that we're talking about here with the rainbow piping instead of what would normally be white piping. Because we got to show our support for gay people. The revolt by seven rugby league players in Sydney, Australia, against wearing a controversial rainbow-detailed gay pride team jersey has widened, a report claimed. The jersey has rainbow stripes and rainbow collar in place of the regular white sections to support LGBTQIA plus inclusion in sports, said the Manly Club on Sydney's northern beaches plans to use it for one game on Thursday night. As Breitbart reported, several Manly players have already ruled out participating, seven of them. Uh, Coach Dan Hassler said the players advised club officials that wearing the pride jersey conflicted with their cultural and religious beliefs. The players will not play Thursday. We accept their decision. These young men are strong in their beliefs and convictions. We'll give them the space they require uh, and support they require. The playing group are solid in understanding of each other's views. As a club, we will wear the jersey on Thursday night. Well, it seems like there are other people that don't want anything to do with this. It's all it takes is some people to actually take a stand and say, you know what, this is stupid. I don't believe in this, and you're not going to make me wear this stupid jersey. Now, other members of the Sea Eagles, as Manly, as the Manly Rugby League Club is known, have indicated they too want nothing to do with this project. Australian rugby players revolt after being told to wear a gay pride jersey. The Sydney Telegraph reported the Seagulls were battling to name a team as a handful of would-be first-timers knocked back a chance to play the game because of similar reason to those who have stood down over being given no choice but to wear the jersey. So think about this. There are people, seven players, right, are sitting. They're not going to play. So that means a lot of people who would never get playing time. This is a huge opportunity for them. They would get the opportunity to go on the field and show what they can do in a big-time game. They're not going to do it. They refuse. They're saying, no, I, I, I really want nothing to do with that. I don't want to be a part of this political game, this virtue signaling identity politics game. So, you know, really kudos to those guys. There's a lot of people that wouldn't be able to stand by those principles. They would take the opportunity, even if it didn't align with their values, just in order to maybe jumpstart their career. The newspaper alleged players were not aware they'd be expected to wear the jersey until after it was first revealed to the media. The story, I think, is going to continue. Obviously, tomorrow, or maybe Australian, they're like 12 or 14 hours ahead of me, I suppose. Maybe even more. So maybe this game kicks off sometime this evening in America. I'm sure we'll hear more about what goes on and what, if any, of these guys decide to actually come out and wear this jersey. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Smash a like button. Subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell for notifications. Share this video out there. And I'll talk to you later.